Welcome to my We Can Do It Keith Haring style tutorial. I chose the image of Rosie the Riveter, created by Howard Miller during World War II in 1942, as my inspiration. Rosie the Riveter is a symbol of American grit and resilience during a great time of hardship. We're going to be creating a Keith Haring inspired illustration in our sketchbooks. I'm demonstrating on loose paper here. Please use graphite pencil to sketch your design idea or message in your sketchbook. Keep it basic and use a stick figure to start. Remember to keep an image of your inspirational reference handy. Here you can see I'm displaying an image of Rosie the Riveter on my iPad so I can develop her into a cookie cutter image. Use a black sharpie for this step. If you're a little nervous, you can start with a pencil and then you can go over it in black sharpie. Be sure to make the black sharpie outline of your cookie cutter person very bold and thick. When you're done, erase the excess graphite. Then you can start adding details, such as motion or movement lines or radiant lines reminiscent of Keith Haring's Radiant Baby. Now it's time to start adding color. Choice media includes magic marker, watercolor pans, and or watercolor pencils. Feel free to combine these as well. I chose to develop my Keith Haring inspired Rosie the Riveter cookie cutter person using watercolor pans and magic markers. I believe Rosie the Riveter is still incredibly meaningful and relevant today and an allegory that represents all people of America and the American spirit, especially during times of hardship. Thank you so much for joining me and I hope you enjoy the process as well.